Hello YouTube, this is Mech and Laura, and that's Roy David123, and, one, three. and if you watched our last episode, we conquered the Ender Dragon, so we built a little monument right next to our Ender, um, Nether Monument, so yeah, over here, we used to have an Enderman, and we caught him, and we named him Enderman, Enderman, the Enderman, but obviously he has left, so yeah. Pretty sad moment. So what are we doing today? Today we are going to build a iron golem farm or an iron farm. So why do we need this iron? Cause we are building a chest thing, a chest automatic chest sorting thing, and it needs over st stacks and stacks of hoppers, and yep. it is a lot of iron. Here's just the how much we did so far but it's gonna sort all, all, all the items automatically and as you can see it's pretty pretty big it has a hundred twenty eight chest and at 64 uh, on each let's side say, let's say four four hoppers four per ho chest yeah yeah four times 128 and it adds up quickly so yeah lots we of need hoppers iron farm. yeah so we're going to build it out of um, snow blocks, so we're going to go ahead and get some snow blocks off camera, and we'll be right back. Alright guys, we are back. We need another pumpkin. Uh, and instead of getting a bunch of snow, we've decided to make a snow farm. So basically how this works is there's a, a snow golem right here, and you just keep hitting the snow underneath him. And it starts creating a bunch of snow, so we can just go around and collect it. So it's quick snow right next to our home, and then we can just put it in these chests. So yeah. David's going to get another pumpkin, and I'm just going to sit here grinding this snow until all my axes break. Yay! <laughs> Yay, this is fun. So I'm going to probably skip it right here, because you probably guys don't want to see this boring work. So... We're just gonna gather a bunch of snow. We'll be right back. Sinkers. All right, guys. <laughs> we finished uh, snow grinding, and we got like ten sn stacks of snow. It was a very tedious process, taking individual snowballs, putting them four times. It was a pain in the butt, but we did do okay. it. And yeah, now we're debating about a no. spot. To keep the farm in. So, yeah. Take it away, David. Uh, the stage fright. <laughs> uh, uh, so, we're thinking of putting it pretty far away because we don't want to he hear the villagers all the time. So, we'll probably mm -hmm. just link it up with like um, a nether portal. Woo! <laughs> she just jumped. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> feather falling. Yeah, yeah, I got feathers falling. So <laughs> that was a fail. <laughs> oh, I'm usually really good. good. I'm re I'm usually really good at this thing. I think here is perfect. All right. Did I bring a shovel? Yes, I did. All right, so we're probably gonna speed up the. Um... Actually, we're gonna probably skip it. Oh yeah, efficiency skip it three. Or skip it because this is gonna be uh, Doc M's design. Yeah. So yeah. <sighs> See you guys soon. There's Rit David doing the moonwalk. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. <laughs> alright. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, we'll be continue this build right here. Uh.
All right. After long hours of building, this is the finished result. Yeah. Pretty big. But now we have to find villagers. So we're probably going to be off to find a village. Because I don't think we found a village yet, have we? Nope. Yeah, I'm getting lag. All right. So I'm just going to skip the video. And see if we can yeah, find some. Soon. Yeah. We're back. We got our villager in here. In these doors of things. David knows what he's doing. He is. This is the start of the infinity breeder. At the top, we need to put one villager in here. The other two are gonna go down there and breed forever. So Yay. yeah. You can hear those doors open and close. So that's good. Um. So yeah, we're gonna go get the other two villagers and put them in there. Oh, this, this is a really tedious project. Like, if you want to make this, you need a good reason to make this, because... Oh. Dude, we could have breathing sleeves. That's the best reason ever. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, we'll be right back. I need, I need more iron. Well, that's why we're doing the Let's iron the golem farm. Oh, really? I didn't know that. I need more <laughs> iron, man. Where are you? What are you doing? I'm getting, preparing for the next villager. Hmm. Hmm. I need to find some coal. Sounds Let's go. I have some coal. Dude, you do realize I have a furnace minecart right now. Do it. You can use two at once. Doesn't matter. That will be faster. Oh, yeah. Uh, get the other furnace minecart. Because we can do two villagers at once. Wait, I need to see this. We. We really. <laughs> I need to make sure he goes in a safe journey because you never know what's going on the real. Creep. Ah. I don't think the rail's connected. What? Never mind. Alright, I... I got the villager in. Whoa! Are you seeing this? It's okay, it's a bug. It's a bug. <laughs> we got the two villies in, and they're breeding, they're starting to breed. You saw that guy with hearts, and he's like glitching through the ground, but he still wants like desperate love. <laughs> he's like glitching through the ground, dude. It's... I want you. <laughs> he's, dude, he's like completely in the ground. What the heck? Dude, look, he's down here. What? Huh? No, it's a glitch. See? Okay. <laughs> what happened to his love, man? Yeah, what happened to your love? Love each other. Maybe I should relog or something. I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. You wanna breed? I command you to breed. Stop staring at me and look at him. Get out of my face, man. Get out of my face. Don't mind me. Like, can you not? Oh, they're breeding. Oh, 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 they're doing it. They're doing it. They're doing it. No. They're doing it. They're... Oh, my God. Don't look. You're too young. Uh... Don't mind me. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. Don't mind me. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm not looking. What? No! Rejection! <laughs> Rejection! Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait! Do they need to, like, synchronize or something? <laughs> I don't know! Synchronized love! Baby Billy! It was a job. Hey, what you looking at, boy? Yeah, yeah bruh. Bruh! Bruh! <laughs> I'm, like, intimidating a child. <laughs> Alright, guys! We're back! 
with our iron golem farm. So now this is up and running. We already have three okay. golems, and we're gonna explain what happens to them. So I'm gonna break this pocket as soon as do. They're going to come in, or not because they're pushing each other. All right, first iron golem. Let's follow them. Look at this big guy. No, right? It's like I'm so tough. So, we go down here, right? Yeah, it just blows down. What a guy. Yeah, what a guy. Why does he have red eyes? I don't know. It's, it's creepy. It's like vines down his arms. I should probably keep moving. I think I'm keeping him from moving. Yeah. Are we there yet? Okay, so we're coming up to some lava. Now, since they are three blocks high, they will be damaged and we won't. It's kind of weird how, like, they're standing in water and their head's touching lava, but they don't get put out. Yeah. So, they so, burn until they're at one and a half hearts, which is right the lowest that, that, this is the lowest that Iron Gold can get. And then, after that, they fall in here. Pressure plate, which finishes off the job, suffocates them, gets picked up by hoppers into a chest. But David is going to edit it so that it goes straight to our automatic item sorter. Yeah, with some minecarts. Yeah. So I'm gonna do that real quick. See you guys soon. I see how. I don't think we ever showed them the furnace room. I did in a tutorial. Well, this is our actual. Furnace room. Let me turn. No, the yeah. Let me turn the sounds down. Ooh. All right. So this is our unfinished like roof. Um, well, it's the furnace room itself is finished. We use like all our iron on this. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Input chest. Output chest. Watch. We we can cook um a sixty four iron in like a less than a minute so it's really good check out my tutorial yeah check out the turbo furnace tutorial um, it's really good actually i like it <clears throat> really efficient mm -hmm. so yeah check it out yeah hey guys we are back what is up hi so we finished the crusher system and this is how it works it's a hover timer there are two stacks of items in it, and every time it fires, it goes to a very long post extender. Very long. It's, and it just extends the pulse, and that goes up to the crusher. And the crusher is up there. It's just basically the um, how the iron golems, when they have only a few bits of health left, it just crushes the life out of them. Yep, and then hoppers suck it up, they put it into this hopper. And the chest should be coming up soon, so... We'll just wait for that to come. So basically, um, it goes into this hopper, and this system right here, I just realized that it's kind of bad. Because it creates, like, it burns out. But I'll fix that later. Basically, when the... Um, Chest card comes, it'll load up. When it's when there's nothing left to load up, it'll go. Yep. Wait. And the chest thing gets sent out every uh, every three minutes or so. So we'll just follow the rail. We had to light this oh. place up a lot just because we had to make sure no mobs would spawn in here. Yeah. So there's all these torches, glowstone everywhere, so that's why. Hi. 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 Uh, okay. Freedom. So over here is another hopper timer and this it just fired and it set it off. Yeah. Basically, that's what happens. And as you can see we already have a bunch of iron and roses in the chest already. And this is from the first like five minutes of starting it up. Yep. So yeah, that's the system. Yep. No I more did. iron mining. 
Yeah. Uh, I think that's gonna be the end of the episode. Yeah. So. Um, so. We're probably gonna go AFK here or in our house for a while and just watch this load up. Yeah, and make a bunch of hoppers, and we'll see you guys next time. This has yeah. been Roy David One Two Three. And Mac and Laura. <laughs> Mac Roycraft. <laughs>